Today, we are going to be writing the formula for the ionic compound copper 2 hydroxide. So, I guess let's start from left to right. Copper is a metal, right? And copper on the periodic table is right here. And copper, if you look on your periodic table, it is a Cu, okay? So, that's my symbol for copper. Copper is always Cu. But since it's a transition metal, it has multiple charges. What charge is copper going to have? Well, that's the Roman numeral. The Roman numeral always tells you the charge of the metal. In this case, it's a 2. So I know that this copper is going to be a plus 2. Now, here's a trick, guys. Okay? Hydroxide, even though it has the IDE ending, this is a polyatomic. You won't find, like, hydrogium or whatever on the periodic table. Hydroxide is a polyatomic ion. That's not going to be on the periodic table. You have to memorize it. That's why I put it here. So hydroxide is always OH minus 1. Now since we have the two charges, we're going to crisscross them to figure out how many of the other guy we need. So this plus 2 is going to crisscross down, telling me that I need two of the whole hydroxides. And this 1 is going to crisscross down telling me that I only need one copper. When you crisscross down, the charges kind of vanish, and it's just kind of like counting numbers. So we're ready to make the formula. It would be Cu. I only need one of them, so I could put a 1, but technically you don't have to. But here's the, the catch, guys. If you have multiple polyatomics, you need to put that polyatomic in parentheses, okay? So since I have two hydroxides, and hydroxide is the polyatomic, I do need to have parentheses, and then that number goes on the outside. And now you are done. So copper 2 hydroxide is just CuOH2. And there you go. I really hope this helped, guys. Let me know in the comments, okay? Love helping you guys out. And if you want to help us out, please press the subscribe button. Thank you so much for that. Good luck on all your tests coming up, and I hope you have a great day. See ya. Bye.